black hoodie, I'm back cooking these goodies. Look at these views from cooking these foods. Yeah. Yo, welcome back to another one. A uh, little steak dinner here for you. All the fixings that I kind of like. Um, I'm very ready to get into it. It's kind of dying right now. Just ev getting everything set up was really difficult. So I'm just gonna waste no time and pour. So we have our glass of ice here ready to go. And we're bringing back this uh, Lipton Mango Passion Fruit Iced Tea. It is killing it for me. So I'm definitely down for that. For this one feels a little more sophisticated than say a Pepsi Zero, a Pepsi Zero you know? Shout out the snowmobiler. <laughs> Taste test. Even though we know it's good. And I'm ready to get into this because like I said, just tough to get everything on the plate, set up and ready to film, so. Hopefully she's still good. I don't know how Quan Tran is always burning his mouth in his videos when he eats because I just, I don't understand the logistics of how he gets to his food so quickly. So anyways, first things first, definitely go for a steak bite. And uh, I've never tried this meth method before, the reverse sear basically. Uh, my method was a little inferior using like a toaster oven and such, but I overcooked it a little bit, unfortunately, but uh, Still good, I think. Give it a try. Still very, 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 very amazing. Figured I'd try a uh, my hand at a little sort of a you know, an onion butter, a lemon, lemon garlic onion butter. Yeah, she's sat too long. She's pretty, 
pretty well done at this point. It was mid-well when I cut it, but it's still mid-well. I like medium, personally. Medium rare is okay, but I personally like medium. It's a New York strip steak. Definitely one of my favorite cuts. I'm not one of these people that's huge into the uh, super fatty cuts. Let's try this with a potato and maybe a mushroom as well. And a mushroom. Mushrooms. Mm. Or where it's at. One of my favorite things to make, honestly. Nice sauteed mushroom. Oil. White wine vinegar. Salt, pepper. sesame oil gives it such a nutty earthy flavor oh man that's so good cook off the uh, green onions with it and uh, a fresh grate of parmesan cheese Asparagus, nice little hit of lemon, still with the crunch. Mm. That's what's up. Such a sucker. Mm. For perfectly cooked vegetables. I just wish I would have got the steak better. I'm really mad at myself. And I only seared it on each side for a minute. But I think I underestimated the toaster oven and I let it go a little longer than I normally would have sour cream potato these are my first time trying these potatoes in uh, the air fryer They didn't get very crisp. They're kind of... They just give way very easily. They're soft. But you can hear that they're not... Like crunchy crunchy. A little ketchup. But the flavor is good. Salt, pepper, oil, a little garlic salt. I wish I had some herbs. I had some like oregano or thyme. Rosemary. a good drink highly encouraged 
All right. Yeah, as you guys can see here, eh? She's just cooked right through. That's such a bummer. Like, I would say the last, I would say the last like three or four steaks I've cooked on the channel, I've overcooked. And I used to be able to execute them perfectly. Which I don't understand. Call me crazy, but that's delicious. I mean, if you're gonna overcook it, might as well hit it with the ketchup, right? <laughs> the blasphemy. It's never made sense to me why people hate ketchup on steak so much because <clears throat> all steak is, <clears throat> what is this happening here? All steak is, is beef. What's a hamburger made of? Beef. Put ketchup on hamburgers. People are too posh sometimes with their expectations. Man, these mushrooms are so where it's at. At this point, I'm just over the knife. So much easier just to use my hand. Which I've learned over time that <clears throat> Seems there's some of you that really like that. It's understandable. Goes back to our primitive nature. First and only meal <clears throat> for the day. And I don't even know when the last time I ate was. I'd say probably a full 24. Really, really back on the one meal a day. I love it. You just feel so light and good most of the time. And then your, your meal is just so extra special, you know? Just drag it through butter. Wow. Just dripping. Perfect. 
pair these up. wasn't a whole lot playing on my mind to talk about today obviously just the food <clears throat> but hey that's what it's all about right cannot let these mushrooms go to waste Way too good. Mm. Best part of the meal. Those mushrooms go dumb hard. All right. That's going to be it. Potatoes are they're just mildly a letdown. I do them different in in, a, in another one to get them crispy. Need to be more crispy. Hope you guys enjoyed that. Till the next one, you know what to do: eat good, live well, stay true.